Hi, my name's John. Hey, I'm Bella. We're from First Team 1100. And we're here for Robotics Explained. And this is our first video, so we want to talk about what exactly is a robot. Well, John, what is a robot? Well, when people think of robots, they think of pop culture robots like R2-D2. Or, or, Transformer Robots in Disguise. Yes, or Transformers. People love Transformers. However, a robot is also other things, like Robots that put together cars on assembly lines. Or your cell phone. Stop texting, please. Your cell phone is a robot. Take it back. Uh, your cell phone is a robot. So is your car or, say, a programmable washing machine. All these are examples of robots. And what the internal components of a robot are is a robot needs to have a brain, it needs to have sensors, and it needs to have input. OK. My phone does not have a brain, John. You're right. Your phone does not actually have a brain inside it. The brain is really a computer. A computer inside the robot tells it what to do with the input. It uses sensors and the controller to process information and output information. So the type of sensors are sort of like what we have? Sort of like, exactly. They're sort of like what we have. They're not exactly like what we have. They don't have eyes and a nose. They have cameras and like touch sensors and something like that. What these sensors allow them to do is it allows the robot to tell what its surroundings are. It can tell what's around it and interact with it thusly. The, uh, the controls of the robot can either be from a computer or from joysticks or something like that. So uh, I'd just like to give you the definition of a robot. A robot is something that <laughs> can, uh, a machine that can perform tasks autonomously. What does autonomously mean, John? Autonomously means that the robot can be pre-programmed to do everything by itself. It doesn't need somebody to tell it what to do. It can do it on its own. Robots have functions like that where they can do things autonomously or at the same time they can take input from a computer. And so, thanks for turning in. I'm sure this was a wonderful time for both of us. <laughs> thanks for tuning in. Catch us next time on Robotics Explained. <laughs>